Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obito Potato, and here we check out the latest and the greatest strategy games each and every day of the week. Bringing you a very interesting one today. This is from Glory to Goo. It's kind of like a survival base builder uh, with a couple of really interesting elements, which I would love to show you. Right, let's jump into things. We're going to kind of just breeze past this. It doesn't particularly matter. I will turn off tutorial pop-ups uh, because I'm going to explain uh, as ever, what the heck is happening. So yeah, it's a bit of a survival base builder. Uh, the premise is kind of interesting. You are playing as a, like, a resistance unit, like an outpost unit, um, and you start with this, uh, with this little base thing, and, uh, we are hopefully gonna protect humanity from all of the weird little aliens that are, uh, taking over space, or something like that. Anyway, uh, yeah, we start with this, we start with this little landing pad, but, uh, we start with this little landing pad, we have come down from this spaceship right here, so always down in the bottom left hand corner, uh, we have got this little, uh, this little interface, and this is, this is a really, really interesting feature, so anything that we impact, or anything that we change on the spaceship will actually impact how we are doing, like, on the ground, so we can actually tweak our gameplay style, uh, by building different modules in the spaceship, there's a bunch of modules that are kind of, uh, in not great shape at the moment. However, uh, we are going to try and fix it up. Anyway, before we get to before we get into that, let's see what we've got going on down here on the uh, on the on the planet. Uh, we've got a little mini map. We're going to be exploring as much as we possibly can. Definitely something that we want to do. Uh, there's a couple of different uh, there's a couple of different sort of biome types here. There's a grassy sort of area, soily area. Doesn't particularly doesn't particularly matter for now. It will matter very shortly. Uh, we got a little overview of all of the resources that we've got. We've got water. We've got electricity. We've got more electricity down here. Uh, I don't know why the electricity bar is up the up the side here, but it doesn't particularly matter. Uh, and then we've got our four sort of uh, our four sort of units that are going to be our four resources that are going to be super useful. We've got effort, which is. Uh, Basically, uh, we get effort, uh, partly from the spaceship, actually, as well, but that's yeah, that's kind of fine. Um, we've got crystals, we've got ore, we need to try and build as many of them as we possibly can. We've got a little population overview, number of workers, produces 0 0.5 effort when not in use. Uh, we've got professionals, produce 2 effort when not in use, and then we've got an expert as well. Uh, we're going to be building a whole bunch of buildings, we're going to be conducting a whole bunch of research. We need to reach 130 population to unlock research, that is probably going to be one of our first priorities. Let's immediately see if we can try and get some, uh, some facilities down. I would like to, I would like to build six houses. I think six houses is good enough to start with. Now, uh, the way that this game works is that everything needs to be connected, right? So every single, every single bit of the, uh, every single little bit of the, uh, of the base needs to be sort of as one. Now, uh, we can do that. We can do that by just building like a bunch of sort of facilities connected together, or we can build connectors. Connects buildings to power supply, water, power, and resources, etc. You can actually see the effort flowing, or the spanners, I guess, flowing into uh, all of the different, uh, all of the different habs here, and that's going to give us a whole bunch of resources. Now, of course, each and every time we complete one of these, our number of uh, our number, our amount of spare water is going to decrease. Our amount of spare power is going to decrease. So, I think it's probably a pretty good idea in the first instance just to get all of the basics sort of set up immediately. Now, the basics include. Uh, a pump. A pump is built on the, there we go, it's built right here, it's built on the green area, the green area is where the water is apparently, and then solar panels we can actually just build, uh, I guess in between, I guess in between there, uh, well, two can be built in between, and then we'll get, uh, we'll get one more. Now, uh, the way that the game works in terms of, uh, enemies is really rather interesting. If I have a little look at my overlays down in the bottom left-hand corner, uh, we can actually see one is center on the captain. The captain is a special unit that we have. Uh, we've currently got four units. We've got four troopers. They're like ranged little machine gunners, starship troopers, that kind of thing. Uh, we've got our, our water overlay, water use, but we don't actually have any water in place at the moment. And then, probably the most important overlay in the game, we've got the suppressed area. The way that these aliens work, and we can actually see one just over here, a little, a cute little hopper. Um, let's actually send somebody up to dispatch of, uh, that unit. Uh, if we send it, if we send a person up here, uh, we can actually just take it out. However, 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 there are many, many, many different types of aliens, and the aliens, uh, primarily unburrow themselves. That's right. So they are actually going to uh, remove themselves from the ground and come and attack us. So before expanding our base in any what given direction, we need to make sure there's a few more over there. 
I'll go and take them out. Uh, we need to make sure that we are suppressing the ground. And we can do that with a building called the Thumper. And that will allow us to extend our area of, uh, of effect. So what I'm currently going to do is just sort of a little bit of... Ooh, interesting indeed. Alien commander identified is the sludge. Reduce number of aliens in each wave. All aliens have additional armor. Greater uh, proportion of lobbers in waves. So, uh, there is going to be a horde that is going to attack us at 33 cycles. We're currently on cycle number 5. Uh, we need to be on the lookout for the horde. I mean, it's pretty it's pretty problematic. You know, we need to, we need to worry about that. Uh, yeah, let's do... Oh, you see that? That was somebody that unburrowed there. So, this is a... This is a Thrasher, and the Thrashers are able to unburrow, which is not exactly ideal. Right, let's do a little patrol over here. Let's do a little patrol over here. And I'll just sort of see what I can do there. Yeah, so yeah, we have a very sort of limited, limited suppressed area over here. And in fact, that is going to end up being problematic if I end up patrolling here. Yeah. Okay, just, you know, just chill out over here. Uh, just chill out over here for now, guys. It's it's fine. Right, we're fine for water. Water is good. The solar panels that we built, uh, that's fine too. What else do we need? What else do we need to get our, our, our infrastructure off the ground? Well, I'll tell you what we need. We need a mining hub. A mining hub goes next to the crystal deposit. And I think a crystal deposit... Let's get a crystal deposit right over there. Uh, this is a crystal deposit. But we can get a mining hub that sort of tucks into tucks into the crystal deposit in order to get uh, in order to get crystals let's connect that up connect that up to the base that's fine make yeah that's a little bit of a misclick but it's not necessarily the end of the world because we're going to need going to need to make sure that that's secure i'd ideally like to find a few choke points right so you know places on the map where we can see mountains there we go you just spawned into the world that's so annoying um yeah, we want to probably try and expand our area of influence. This is the ore. This is the ore type. So we've got zero ore incoming at the moment, but we're going to need to get ore. So we're going to need to try and build out this way anyway. Let's uh, let's do that. Yeah, this is this is going to be a problem. My captain has got a special ability, which allows me to like do a rocket mounted uh, arm 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 missile thing. So that's kind of nice. That's good. It's a nice little nice little thing. And my captain is also a little bit stronger than everybody else. And he can also level up, which is kind of nice. Uh, if we have a little look. Remote drone sensor launches a probe that will reveal an area and fly to a designated location. Uh, we've got Raptor MG fires a stream of bullets at the target. Or we've got boost the attack speed of all friendly units in range. Uh, plus range 10%. I think I will take the audio stimulator. Uh, we can actually see the equipables here. Uh, we can unequip uh, like lasers and whatnot. It's fine. True protect speed, admirable, uh, admirable uh, crew efficiency. Max level is four. That's fine. We don't need to worry about that at the moment. Right. Okay. So that's sort of uh, the, the main, I guess, civilian buildings in the game. We're going to get a drill mine over here as soon as we possibly can. Uh, we're going to get a thumper expanded, but I need to get pretty urgently. I need to get a barracks. We're going to get a barracks we need more crystals. I need to get a barracks pretty much as soon as possible so that we can start training more troops. We will do that. Uh, I am also going to see if I can try and get a lab, although we don't need a lab in order to start research. The lab needs to be built on a very specific type of terrain that I'm not sure that I can actually that I can actually find, but that's fine. And then we've also got some walls. We've got gates and we've got bunkers. Uh, yeah, I would like to get all of these things, but I would like to be very careful about where I actually put my put my defenses. Yeah, I think, you know what I think we want to do? I think we want to expand out here. How much is it going to take for me to get a thumper? Five crystals? Let's do this, let's do this over here. Now, if I place down a building, it is going to be somewhat threatened. There we go, build that back here. Uh, we can also build a little turret thing, a small tower, which is really rather nice. I'm going to build that as soon as we possibly can. I'm going to need more crystals, hence why I'm expanding out to here. We'll get some additional crystals, and then, or we'll build an additional crystal mine, which should help out a lot. And then we'll get the barracks. So, yeah, that's the order of operations. We'll get this built, then we'll get the barracks, and then we'll get, and then we'll get all sorted. Shouldn't be too long. Shouldn't be too long at all. Let's get the mining hub. Area not suppressed. Okay, there are enemies over here. That is worrying. Okay. Let's attack. It's fine. 
Still fine for power. Still fine for everything. Mining hub is going to be a great addition. Let's get this all cleaned up. There we go. Beautiful. Might attract a few extra enemies, but that's fine. At least we'll have down a little turret that is going to allow us to do a lot of the defending uh, manually. If we have a little look at our suppression range, that is fine. I am happy with this. This is good. Probably want to defend this area. Definitely want to defend this area. We don't have anybody over here. That is a massive, massive oversight. We don't have anyone down here. That's probably a pretty big oversight too. But we don't have... I suppose we can move that troop over here for now. Uh, we just don't have the troops that we need in order to run this operation effectively. So let's get... Let's get the barracks. Let's get the barracks down as soon as we possibly can. We now have two mining hubs, which is great. We're going to get some walls. Probably want to wall off this entire area. I don't really foresee myself trying to move down south. So let's see if we can try and wall this area off. And in fact, now is a great time to build walls because we have got loads and loads of effort spare. There we go. We'll build a gate there and... Is that, did that end up... Is that a wall? Is that a proper wall? Too close to the enemy? I kind of thought that was the case. Building under attack. Where's the building under attack? Don't think we're under attack. Oh, it was the gate. That's fine. That's okay. We can rebuild that relatively easily. Okay. Good. Uh, let's rebuild the gate. Excellent. And that gets built over there. Good. And let's extend this out here. We're actually a little bit low on the old power. Let's fix that up. Beautiful. And let's keep expanding over here. Da -da 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 -da. Too close to the enemy. Okay, that's fine. We can we can clean out the enemy here. Whatever the case, we should be we should be grand. Solar panels are being built just before we run out. That's perfect. And this wall should be great. This is a nice defensible position to be in. We still need to get ourselves additional... Well, an additional, a first barracks. Very important. Move back. Beautiful. Nice. Okay. That's fine. We are A-OK -okay with that. That is good. Okay, let's get a barracks. Get a barracks as quickly as we possibly can. Barracks right over here. Let's get that built quick, 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 quick. Uh, we'll start training some additional troops. And then we will probably prepare for the horde, which is coming in about 10 cycles, which doesn't sound like a lot, but... Uh, well, it's not a lot. Put it that way. So yeah, everything needs to be connected. We're actually pretty good i think in terms of connection this is a pretty decent wall this is a nice place to defend i like the fact that we've got the gate there uh we might want to get a bunker over here somewhere there we go destroy you in fact we'll probably try and just push up here and hold right barracks is built what do we got what do we got we can build troopers uh, laser guns don't pack a punch, but by vibrations are limited. That's fine. Reclaimed. Borrowed goo can't detect infected humans, but they can't be trusted to wield anything more dangerous than a sword. Little bit cheaper. They cost us fewer crystals, which is worth bearing in mind. And a mortar team. Mortar team lob grenades at long distances. So that is probably the best unit to get, but we don't have any ore at the moment. So we're going to, we're going to need to do something about the ore situation. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to try and thump out over here. Area not suppressed. I know it's not suppressed, but we can deal with it. Okay, see if we can try and move out a little bit. Let's get, uh, set the rally point to be there, build a few additional troopers, and let's see if we can try and just hold the captain here for a little while. There we go. Nice. Okay, can I finish this wall over here? We can indeed finish the wall over here. Nice. Okay, and let's also see if we can try and get a turret. Do I want to get a turret there? Probably not. I mean, we need to get a... Thumper is being completed. That's great. Let's uh, let's move out here. 
That's good. Also, uh, you can see that periodically aliens will attack the ship. Uh, interestingly, the alien, the number of aliens attacking the ship, it depends on how much thrust efficiency we have. Uh, the faster that we're able to make the ship go, the more uh, unlikely it is that aliens are going to be able to board. So that's just something to bear in mind. Uh, again, the ship is not the primary concern at the moment. We need to sort the rest of it. Right, okay. Mining, I need a mining operation. Drill mine needs to go in here. Not enough effort, 250 effort. We need much more effort. And in fact, I think we're going to get more population. Let's uh, let's do that. Yeah, nice. I think that's a decent amount of additional population. We may need to get some additional water supplies. If I need to get some additional water supplies... That's not a bad place to do it. Sure. Quick, get back, get back here. Get back here. There we go. Absolutely not having that. Uh, we can repair. We can repair all buildings for six effort. Not a major, not a major expenditure there at all. Happy to do it. Okay. Are we good? We're good for we're good for most things. We're good for most things. We're good for everything with the exception of water. Move these units back a little bit. Keep them out here for now. That's fine. Okay, water, we're back. We're back fine for it. Let's get uh, let's get this drill mine zoned. Not enough effort. 250 effort. That's fine. Let's uh, let's actually let's actually see if we can zone one of these first. Okay. So that's going to be right at the edge of our suppressed area here. Okay. Get these guys down here. And let's see if we can try and maybe claim, build a few more. Looks like the horde is going to be coming from this direction. Uh, honestly, as directions to take an attack from go, that's pretty good. We need 180 effort in order to get this turret built. I think we can do that. I think we can do that. Uh, I'm going to have to move. I'm going to have to move a few more units over here to cater for it. There we go. I think we can shoot through the gate, which is quite nice. Let's get these guys out front. Let's get the captain moved across. As soon as this is built. Can I build a build an additional turret? Let's have a little look. I might not be able to build it in time, but at least it's going to be a good thing to do. Right, Horde is approaching. We can see it on the mini-map. You guys out front. Get you out front. Okay. Captain? Oh, Captain, my Captain. Let's get you out over here, shall we? Again, you're probably not going to be able to walk fast enough, but it's worth it. It's worth moving you across just for the uh, just for the occasion. Okay. Also going to need to get one more solar panel. Right. Okay. Move over here. We can shoot through walls, which is quite nice. Uh, I'm not really anticipating any difficulty. We might lose a wall, but nothing too crazy. This is the first horde, so like, you know. There we go. Nice. Very, very nice. 32 effort to repair all the walls. That's really, really good. That is really, really good. Oh my goodness, my thumper has been lost. My thumper has been lost. That is absolutely huge. Uh, get down here. Ugh, oh, that's so annoying. Ugh. Oh. Okay. That is really, really annoying. That's, uh... We need 200 effort in order to... In order to build this. Well, let's get it built. Let's get it built immediately. Yeah, so we are in unsuppressed territory now. Which is problematic. My wall over here. Uh, yeah, let's get another... Get another turret. Not enough effort. 180 effort required. Uh, okay, that's fine. Get you to go out. Get you to go out over there. Okay, we're thumping. That's good. Let's get this reconnected. Nice. Okay, right. Okay, we're on uh, 60. And we're going to be... We're going to be dealing with 
more stuff in a little bit. Let's get you repaired. Excellent. Let's immediately start off mining. This drill mine... 250 effort. Man, we need more effort. We need more effort. How are we going to get more effort? We need to turn our attention to the to the sky. And in fact, let's pause and have a little look at what we got going on up here. So, thruster. Increases the thrust of the spaceship, enabling avoidance and improved support capabilities. Fine. We've got quarters. Hold your ship crew and colonists. More space improves the efficiency of all systems. Love it. Uh, then we've got the reactor. Generates energy that powers other modules of your ship. So we've got launcher. It sends the shuttle to and from your base. Okay. And then we've got a few modules that are empty and need to be repaired, which we're going to do soon. And let's repair this one in the first instance. Uh, module unexplored, build an adjacent module to reveal what lurks here. We're going to be doing that. Uh, but what I want to build, we've got thrusters, we've got the quarters. The laboratory generates research points that reduces the cost and speeds up research. Very, very nice. Very interested in doing that. I'm also interested in the manufacturing zone. Manufacturing zone generates effort for your colony below. Let's do that. Let's absolutely do that whilst we've got a few, a few crystals that are spare. We've also unlocked research, so let's let's at least dive into that. Uh, set fire to aliens in a wide arc. Carefully, uh, careful, careful, they may explode. Uh, we've also got robotics. Generates effort based on the number of nearby nearby habs. Uh, I'll take that. You know, 250 effort. That seems like a pretty darn good deal. I think in in the grand scheme of things. So we'll do it. 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 Okay. Do I need any additional? troops i probably do need additional troops although i really can't can't cope with that right let's go and have a little look up here what do we got do we need to build it build build an adjacent module uh 30 ore we have nowhere near the resources to build that thruster laboratory build another manufacturing zone i could build another manufacturing zone we need a few more crystals in order to make that happen although we can we can do that fairly fairly easily research is looking pretty darn good uh, but I think I need to get, I think I really just need to get this drill mine sorted. It's not going to take too long to get, uh, to get the extra effort. But we'll get it. Brilliant. Okay. That's going to allow us to build a whole bunch of resources like mortars and whatnot. But I should also just be building more troopers, I think. Maybe a mortar team as soon as we can anyway. Right. Build as many additional troops as we can. There's a hole in my defenses over here, by the way. Yeah, I need to correct that. Okay, get back in here. Pause and build a... Right. That over there. And then let's get... Oh, yeah, we can level up the captain. What do we need? Uh, heal surrounding friendly units. Launch a grenade that burns aliens. Or purifier. Fires a stream of liquid napalm. Uh, heck yeah, let's go for a liquid napalm stream. Let's equip our, equip our commander with that. Let's get a... I don't need to get... I don't need to get any further... Uh, upgrades. I don't need to get any, any further towers. I'm pretty happy with my tower situation. I would maybe want to get an additional tower over here. If anywhere... In fact, let's do it. I'd much rather be safe than sorry. Uh, mines are looking good. Power, we need a little bit of additional power to sort out. Let's, uh, let's fix that. Not enough effort. Of course we don't have enough effort. We are very, very low on the old effort. Barracks exit blocked. Okay, that's fine. Right, I'm also going to get more, more habs. Not enough effort. 35. That's fine. Okay. Uh, right, research-wise, research, -wise, research uh, reach a population of 200 to unlock. We are a little bit of a ways away from that, but I can at least work on the flamer when we have the appropriate amount of, uh, of effort. Okay, build that. It's good. Let's move you out of here so that we can build an additional hab right in the center. Nice. That is all looking fine. Uh, yeah, we are going to need more. We're definitely going to need more power. So let's do it. Walter, we're still technically fine for. Mortar team is almost ready to go. We just need one more bit of ore. Now, I can also build the... I can also build the lab, but the lab requires, like, very specific building conditions. It needs to be built on water ruins. Not enough effort. I think, is this a water ruin? I guess we'll, we'll see about that. We'll see about that as we go. Uh, right, can I build something else up here? 
I think I kind of want to. Yeah, give me a, a manufacturing zone. That's fine. And we'll also see if we can start doing some more repairs. Some more repairs. We can also send you to the ship. Uh, somehow. Yeah, we can send you to the ship like so. We can't send anybody else to the ship. Right. That's fine. Damage module. Let's... Let's repair this one. Repair that one. That's fine. Okay. We're still spending our resources. This is still good. Uh, I would like to get some more water production. 18. Okay. And honestly, I'm thinking that we probably need to get another, another turret over here. And maybe even a wall. I'd like to push... I'd like to push my units around this way. See if we've got anything. Any idea on when the next horde is going to be coming? It's going to be coming in seven waves. That's fine. If I push any further, we're going to start to see a whole bunch of enemies start to unburrow. It's a pretty... It's a pretty busy area just as it stands, but it's fine. Okay, there's a lot of enemies here. A retreat. Bring my captain across just to... Just to see. Uh, just to see his abilities. Okay, nice. So far, so good. Nothing too crazy. Walter's looking good. Keep on exploring. Yeah, so they're starting to unburrow around me. Lot of units. Lot of units. Okay. We're under attack. Losing power? That's okay. Oh my goodness. Okay, we are actually significantly under attack. There we go. Destroy those guys. And we'll do a little st stimulant thing. Nice. Okay, we need to build a little bit more power. We need to get all of our buildings repaired. Uh, still no sign on where the enemies are going to be coming from. Uh, I need 200 population, which I am still like a little bit away from uh but the good news is is that we can get flamers researched so i'm absolutely going to do that let's hop back upstairs see if we can maybe get a research lab how much do we need for a research lab it's 20 20 ore and 10 of this stuff i don't know why we get that stuff so uh, i guess we'll just keep repairing the uh keep repairing the modules keep repairing the modules on the ship and doing a bunch of research horde is going to be coming from the south here that's fine you know let's get a mortar team Let's get a mortar team. Let's get two of them. Let's get both of them down here. And then we'll get two additional troopers. That's okay. We're fine with this. We're very, very fine with this. Commander is going to get moved across here in anticipation for the attack. We're going to keep probably most of our troops. A few of our troops over here. And then the rest are going to be moved uh, out to the other side. We're losing a little bit of power. Let's get a... That need... That's a terrible place to build that. Horde approaching. I know, I know. Let's build one here, one there, and then more around the corner there. That's fine. Okay. The horde is coming. We've got a mortar team that is just moving down right now, so that's great. Research is complete. Can I build a flamer? How much is a flamer going to cost me? Uh, 140 effort. That's a little bit, of, a little bit too much effort for me. Uh, maybe in anticipation I should build more. Yeah, I should build more habs. I don't have any... I don't have enough, uh... I don't even have enough... Enough effort to build that many habs. But that's fine. We'll do it. We'll do it nonetheless. Building more solar panels. Building more habs. This is fine. Okay. The horde is... The horde is ready. Let's get everything repaired. And let's get ready to face the... Let's get ready to face the... The day. Right. Flamer. We're negative water. We're negative water, but that's fine. We're negative water, but that's fine. That's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Get one flamer, and then let's actually send these guys out front. I think they're going to attack over here. Ah, they're going to attack. Uh-oh. Oh, my giddy ants. Oh my god. Oh my god. 
Oh my god, they're all- they are absolutely pounding me. I can't do anything! Get the flamer over here. No, they're gonna break through. Don't- don't move. There we go. Nice. Oh my goodness gracious me. Okay, you need to head up here and take out that unit before it destroys all my turrets. Oh, okay. Uh, well, we lost a little bit of wall. We lost a we lost a captain, uh, which is pretty disappointing because my captain is uh, dead now. I don't know if I don't know if he comes back. I have absolutely no idea if he comes back. Okay, move back over here. We're still fine. We're fine for everything. Our water situation needs to be repaired. Good, repair that. Let's get walls back in action. Nice. And then let's just yeah, let's regroup. Let's regroup after a little bit of a after a little bit of a loss. What do we got here? Uh cannon. Uh fire shells to support the colony. Heck yes, I'm gonna get that. That is brilliant. I'd also like to get that in another position over here. If we can, reactor generates power. Uh not enough crystals. We need a few more crystals. That's okay. We can do that. I'm actually surprised that we've managed to, at least for the moment, survive without too, too many crystals. We're going to get more of these flamer guys, by the way, because they are absolutely flipping awesome. My colony still isn't big enough. That's okay. That's okay. My colony still isn't big enough to support any additional people. So I'm going to get we need more effort. That's fine. Walter is going to be fixed soon. Soon enough, anyway. Uh, and then we're probably going to run out of power yet again, but we'll just expand a little bit. There we go. Yeah, I definitely need more effort. I definitely need more effort, and I need more ways to generate effort. That is pretty important. Right. Lost water. That's fine. Don't worry. Yeah. So there's, it says there's a lack of power here, but I don't think it's a lack of power. I think it's a lack of water. Yeah, I think it's definitely a lack of water. Okay, build a solar panel, like, right in the corner there, if we can. As soon as we can. Right, I'm still building more flamers. Uh, I should have had my mortar, I should have had my mortar units on the inside. Yeah, that's pretty embarrassing. Build that over there. Okay, good. Uh, right, we've got our we've got our turrets coming down now. Are we at 200 population yet? We're at 170 population. That is nowhere near where we need to be. Absolutely nowhere near where we need to be. Uh, there is going to be another horde approaching at level 88, which is uh, quite an impossibly large task to potentially defend against. Let's get one more mortar team. Yeah, two units stationed up here, I think, is fine. They can climb over the rocks. They can definitely climb over the rocks. So we need to be we need to be like abundantly abundantly safe with uh with that. That's looking good. Do we need to build any more stuff? I would like to get quarters. What's the cheapest? This is probably the cheapest. Let's build that, because I'd like to get towards this uh cannon. Structure. That's quite nice. Right. Deploy captain. Oh, yeah, that's Not enough ship energy. Oh, it needs to be energy specifically on the ship oh, I'm gonna need to get a reactor, am I? Yeah, build a reactor uh, Build another reactor as soon as we have the ability to do that And then we'll see if we can try and deploy that the cannon is gonna go is gonna go absolutely gangbusters That's great. Cool. Love it absolutely love it. Oh, this is the ship energy. I didn't realize that's the ship energy versus uh, my energy uh, down on the surface. Can't action ship disabled. Lots and lots of aliens up here. We should be okay. We should be okay. We'll be fine. Okay. There's a lot to, there's a lot to manage here. There's a lot to manage. Population is very, very close to being exactly where we need it to be. Nice. 
Another reactor. Beautiful. Let's do it. Very, very happy with that. Okay, we're going to hit 200 population. That is great. Is that going to give me... Purifier RX laser? I would absolutely like that, please. And then we'll see if we can try and get you down here as soon as we can. There we go. What's our thumping range looking like? Pretty much just at the edge of it. That's okay, though. Right, Walter is not good. Like, it's really, really, really not good. Uh, we need so much more of it that it is actually kind of worrying. That is a very stupid place to build that. Because that is almost certainly going to trigger the enemies. Let's get some of my flamers up here, shall we? Yeah, I knew that would happen. Who would have seen that one coming? Either way, that is where I need to build the water. Okay. Move back, move back. There we go. Okay, gorgeous. Gorgeous, glorious. Oh my goodness gracious me. There's like an octopus thing that is flying around there. Uh, that sucks. That sucks hard. Right, my ship is looking my ship is looking great. Let's get the captain deployed. Let's get the captain deployed. That's nice. Let's keep on building out here. Do we need more reactors? No, I don't think we do. Maybe a thruster? Let's get a thruster. Let's get a thruster and then let's build another cannon in, in, the, in that position. Okay. Too close to enemy. That's okay. Let's get a thumper. Oh, robotics generates effort based on the number of uh, number and quality of surrounding surrounding houses. Uh, yeah, that'd be pretty good, I suppose. That's quite a lot of effort. If we if we trash that hab in the middle there, if we trash that hab in the middle there, then put that in there. That's cool. And then those two, I think, would give us what we're after. Let's get a thumper. Actually, the thumper here is not too bad. Like, that actually covers the area not not too badly. Uh, we'll build a turret. We'll build a turret there. Uh, with two additional turrets, and I think we're just going to wall this entire area off, and we're just going to pretend like it doesn't exist. Uh, actually, we can't do that, of course, because that is going to completely destroy our ability to collect water. I'd completely forgotten that. So, the water... Turret, uh, the water tower puts out these little, these little feelers. There we go. The water tower puts out these little feelers that uh, determines how how many water uh, things it gets, and I think we're gonna have to leave it open in order to, in order to allow it to happen. Uh, right, we've we've hit two hundred population. What have we got? A factory takes in ore from nearby mines and outputs twice as much. I like it a lot. A flying scout that most aliens can't reach. I like that too. A gun turret. I really like the idea of a gun turret. 350 effort. I'll, I'll take that right now. Uh, let's also pop back upstairs. See if we can try and build a cannon. I would love to build a cannon. We're going to be able to do that pretty darn soon. Uh, can I get some more flamers? I can. Can I get some more mortar teams? I almost can. We're very close. Very close. Uh, I also need to get myself a few more solar panels. Very, very close to having the right number of solar panels. Okay, good. So, we need more mortar teams. We need the small cannon upstairs to be built. One more of those. Good. And the final, the final wave is going to be coming at me, and it's going to be coming at me really soon. How do I feel about this? Not overwhelmingly positively. Not overwhelmingly positively. That is a way of putting it. That is definitely one way of putting it. 25 crystals. 25 crystals. We'll get there. We'll get there. Okay. Research complete on the gun turret. What do we got? Auto cannon tower is 15 crystals. 10. Okay. We're going to be seeing the enemies come from north and south. Not enough effort, 250 effort required. Let's get, uh, 
Let's get a let's get a gun turret in both the north and the south area. Let's also see. What did I say that we needed? Armory. Build an armory. Generates marines that help repel the attack. That's cool. Oh, that's very very cool. Still need twenty five crystals to to get that uh, to get that built though. Let's get this over here. I think the turret the turret down south is more important than anything than anything else right now. Let's also see if we can try and get some additional units. Mortar team, maybe. Yeah, one more mortar team. That'd be good. Crystal-wise, we might be able to get... We might be able to get a little bit more. I'm really worried about this southern sort of area here. Let's... Let's do that. Okay, we'll 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 build we'll build what walls we can in the limited time that we have. Yeah, negative water is not exactly ideal, but there's frankly not very much we can do about this at the present moment. Okay, ship is under attack, and we are in the middle of the wave. Okay, I can't do anything about this. Okay, mortar tech team over there. Mortar tech team over over here. Flamer, you're going to go south as well. Okay. Everything is prepared. We are ready. We are officially as ready as we are ever going to be. Let's... Let's see. Right. You need to be... No, you need to be over here. I told you you need to be over there. Okay. Frontline troops. I know we're out of water. Frontline troops, go. Attack. Defend the colony. Defend. Get the minigun cannon thing. Minigun cannon. Bring that down. Bring that down. Okay, we've repelled in the north. Attack! Get more troops over here. More troops. Go, 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 go! Go, 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 go! Go! Stim the troops. Don't die, Captain. Retreat! Retreat from there! We're bombing! Nice! Attack! Your flamethrowers! The hope of millions rest on your ability to utilize a, fl a flamethrower correctly. Train more troops! Well, I, I tell you what, we managed to repel the, uh, managed to repel the vast bulk. Oh, we got more troops. You down here. You down here. Come, 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 help out. Oh, the music is epic as well. Hey, we actually did it. That was fantastic. Okay, that was like really, really, really really rough, uh, but we managed to get all the way to the end, and we managed to repel that last uh, fantastic attack. Uh, from glory to goo, ladies and gentlemen, uh, it's still a little bit rough around the edges, don't get me wrong. This is a demo. Uh, the fact that you have to edge pan, I find absolutely annoying as heck. That being said, um, I feel like we barely scratched the surface of the potential for this game, and I'm super excited to uh, to see where it goes from here. But anyway, yeah, we're going to wrap it up for now. Thank you ever so much for watching. My name, of course, has been Obita Potato. Check out the Patreon if you're interested in helping make videos like this possible. I'll catch you next time. Bye.